In this video, we will fix API MS WinCore Science.dll in Windows 10, 8, and 7. So let's begin. To solve that, what you have to do is just go in the description. There will be a link to this page that says download API MS Win Core Sench .dll. So when you once you are redirected to this page, just scroll down below and here we have download section. You have to just go and download the both 32 bit and the 64 bit. Just go and download the both. So here is a 32 bit download. I would just go to download the 64 bit. So both are downloaded. Now I would just go to the download folder. And here I have both as 32 bit and 64 bit. Just go and extract them. And here extract them. Extract the second one that is 64 bit. Now you need to know that what is your system? It's 64 bit or 32 bit. For that, just go to your this PC, right click it, and click on properties. In here, you can see the add system type as 64 bit operating system. You can see your operating system by going to this page. Just go and close it. Now you know what is your system. It's 32 bit or 64 bit. So just go and for 32 bit, just go and copy it. This is the file. Just go and copy it. Just go to your local disk C, local disk C, open it. Here go to Windows. And here just scroll down below and search for System32. Here I have System32, just go and open it. And here just go and paste it. Click on Continue. And here it is. Now we have done what we need to do for 32-bit system. Now we will come to 64-bit system. In the case of 64-bit system, you would have a folder with name of syswow64. In the case of 32-bit system, would you, you would not have this folder. Now what you have to do is just go the 32, just, just go and copy the 32-bit DDL file and paste it in syswow64. Copy 32-bit DDL file and paste it here at syswow64. And here just click on continue. Once you have done so, go back and here copy the 64-bit file and here go to your windows and paste it in system32. In the second step for 64-bit what you have to do is just copy the 64-bit.dll file and paste it in system32. And here paste it, replace the file in the destination, continue and here it is. Now you have done all the steps, hope the problem will be solved. If you still have any issue, you can comment below, I will try to answer that. But before you go, please subscribe, like and share. Thank you.